Hey guys, it's Jake here with eTrailer. Today we're gonna to talk about some tips and tricks when looking for an RV to take your furry friends camping with you. The first thing you wanna consider is the amount of space that the RV is gonna have and how big your dog or dogs are. If you have a larger dog, you're typically gonna to wanna to look into a little bit larger RV. And if you have a smaller dog, you might be able to get by with a smaller RV. The other thing when it comes to thinking of space is you wanna be sure that your pet has a safe place when you're in travel. Um, this means in the vehicle itself, if you're pulling a camper or in an RV, you wanna be sure that there's a safe place for them to be when you're driving down the road. The second thing is, is you wanna be sure that your dog is comfortable with steps. So Woofy here does not wanna go inside this RV. Come on, buddy. <laughs> He's like, oh no. Yeah, there you go, come on. There we go. Come here, buddy. Okay, you can do it. I know you can do he goes, it. nope, yeah. not doing it. Come on, Woofy. Let's go back down. <sighs> so you wanna be sure if your dog is not okay with steps, maybe look into an RV that has maybe one step or no steps. If the steps are the only issue about the RV that your dog does not agree with, there are ramps available to be able to get up into the RV easier. Now, another thing to consider when looking for an RV, if you have a pet, um, typically a campsite is not going to be um, super clean, and if it if at all you get rain over the weekend, um, we don't recommend getting an RV with carpet inside. Um, you can see here on Woofy, we just have a rainy, snowy day here, and he's lapping up quite a bit of water. So we'd hate to see you spending the weekend cleaning the carpet inside your RV. If your dog is bothered by loud noises at home, chances are they're going to be bothered by noises at the campsite because the walls of your camper are much thinner than that on your house. So um, this is just a courteous thing. If your dog, regardless if it's inside the camper or out, uh, nobody wants to hear your dog barking when they're at their campsite trying to relax. When looking into RVs, you wanna be sure that if you're going to be camping in some hotter climates or some cooler climates, you wanna be sure that your RV has a furnace and an air conditioning unit so that you can keep the temperature inside your RV climate controlled for your furry friend. All in all, we love to hear the stories about you guys taking your pets on camping trips because that's getting you and the dogs outside to enjoy nature. If you have any cool tips or stories that you want to share with us, please drop them in the comments below and we'll see you next time.